After more than a dozen drownings on area waterways this summer, a group continues to drive home the importance of swimming safety. Collins Hope was founded three years ago after a young Austin boy drowned. As YNN's Jeff Stensland shows us, groups outside the nonprofit are also doing what they can to help spread awareness. It all happened so quickly um, and it changed my life forever. Rima Starr describes the day she lost her three-year-old son, Kevin Shea. Almost 40 years have passed, but it's still clear in Rima's mind. He actually had hit his head um, jumping in a pool and nobody noticed that right away and so he was unconscious. Efforts to bring Kevin back weren't enough. He died that day. It's unbelievable. Alyssa Magram has made it her life's mission to educate parents and kids about water safety. She's executive director of Collins Hope, a nonprofit founded by the parents of Colin Holst. He drowned in a pool in June 2008 at the age of four. The biggest thing probably is constant visual supervision. I mean, never leaving, never taking your eyes off of children when you're in and around water. Colin drowned in a swimming pool at a fitness center, but still swimming safety needs to be observed here at Lake Travis as well. Already this year, several people have drowned out here at this lake alone. From Memorial Day through I think June 28th is the most recent stats. You know, Texas is leading the nation in the number of drownings. And that's not a good place to be. Magram says parents need to be equipped with CPR training and a fixed eye on their children. Collins Hope has given out more than 50,000 packets with distress whistles and a water guardian pledge. A fashion and runway show Sunday was designed to bring the message to a new audience and raise money to further the reach of Collins Hope. Star wants families to understand how fast they can lose a loved one. We don't want to have another year with this many um, drownings occurring or any at all. It only takes this much water to drown. At Lake Travis, Jeff Stensland, YNN. Water safety advocates say drowning can take just two minutes to happen. Most children die if they're underwater for six to ten minutes. All the money raised Sunday will go to benefit Collins Hope.